When you shoot high, you're gambling that the puck's faster than the goalie's reflexes. In this case, he was right. Wow, it's really not fair when a guy can shoot it like that. Nice goal. He's going to score more often than not with that kind of slap shot. He really stepped into that slap shot and ripped it past the netminder. Boards! He put it upstairs and the goalie just wasn't fast enough. From the backhand to the back of the net in one smooth motion. The goalie had no chance on that shot. Great goal on the backhand. That's not easy. Many say the backhand is the toughest save in hockey. The goalie has no clue where it's... The open ice available in the four-on-four -four situation lends itself to more wide-open hockey. The offense took full advantage on that scoring play. And it better check the puck for cracks after that slap. No doubt. Good thing it didn't hit the goalie. Might have knocked him into the net as well. That's a power play goal. If you can take advantage of the power play on a regular basis, you'll get more than your share of wins. Terrific power play effort right there. And it got them the goal. That's how you draw it up on the chalkboard, no doubt. He really rifled that one-timer home. They say a quick release is more important than accuracy at the NHL level. The goalies won't argue with that one. Bars. He hammered home that slap shot. What a blast. It's going to be downright scary for a goalie when a guy can let it loose with that kind of velocity. That was a blistering slap shot. I don't think there's a goalie around who could have stopped that blast. He scores! a good wrist shot. He let go of the wrist shot, and it paid off handsomely with that. That's right, you don't always have to wind up with a big slapper to get it past the keeper. <laughs>